Hello everyone, it's Jack here and we're back looking at another mod for Minecraft. Now this is called the Fishing Plus Plus mod and it adds about 10 new species of fish to the game along with a few other new fishing tools and upgrades. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of the stuff you can craft. So first off there is a reinforced fishing rod which is 3 pieces of iron then two pieces of string and it creates a reinforced fishing rod now this is pretty much the same as what you get in the normal vanilla game except it's got twice the endurance so that's pretty cool the next thing we're going to take a look at is the i think it's called the treasure trawler so it's a diamond two pieces of gold now this is very expensive but it's actually really useful so it creates a treasure trawler so we'll take a look at them in a second and also there is two sticks and a piece of string and this gives you a worm net which is going to be used for baits so you can use the worm net on sand to get blood worms, use it on dirt. Now sometimes this doesn't work, it depends which block you use it on, but there's the earthworms, what you get from dirt. From netherrack you get the demon worm, and from endstone you get the void worm. So let's go ahead and have a walk down to the beach and we'll take a look at the new fishing rods and some of the contraptions which I've got set up down there, so I'll see you in a little minute. Okay then, so we're finally down at the beach, um, let's go ahead and take a look at the reinforced fishing rod first. So this takes um, two blocks of iron and two string, and it lasts about, ooh, it lasts a lot longer than the normal fishing rod to be honest. Um, I have used this a little bit since I made it, and it's not really deteriorated much, so that's pretty awesome, I will admit. So we've got a raw fish there, uh, this is capable of catching all the fish in the mod, so don't worry about that. And just a minute, let me turn that storm off because that's probably going to annoy you. And here we have the treasure trawler. Now this is a really awesome piece of kit. It's two gold, one diamond and two string. And it allows you to get just random things out of the water. I mean, I've got bricks, <laughs> iron, diamonds even. It's just really random and you've got like a certain percentage of a chance of getting different things each time. You've just got to be really patient and I think I clicked that at the wrong time there. Um, and yeah, you can get random stuff out of this. So, oh, oh! I got three three diamonds. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. So as you can see, that's pretty useful. And these are two machines what can be made. Now, I'll pop the crafting recipes up on the screen now. Because I'm, I'm not really going to go in depth and show you how to craft uh, certain things. You can sort of uh, work that out for yourself if you want to try this mod out. But this is a raw fish catcher. Now, it catches raw fish and puts them in this chest here. And you pop them in the furnace. And you get some lovely fish, which uh, tastes very nice. And, um, yeah. And the, it's a little bit buggy to set up at first, but once you get the hang of setting it up, it works pretty efficiently. It's pretty cool. And this is a cooked fish catcher. Now, I haven't got this working yet. I think I've set this up wrong, and I'll have to figure it out soon. But basically, what this does is it takes the raw fish. Instead of catching raw fish and putting it in a chest, it just cooks the fish when it catches it and puts cooked fish in here. So that's pretty awesome. So I think I've showed you most of the tools what can be crafted, the uh, worm net, the fishing rods, and so on. So I think I'll go ahead and show you some of the fish which have been added with this mod, so here you go. Okay then, so the first fish we're going to take a look at is the carp. Now this heals one and a half hunger when raw, three hunger when cooked, and has a 75% catch rate. And to catch it, you need to use seeds as bait. So these fish are pretty common, I've found quite a bit of these, um, so I expect to see quite a lot of these as you're fishing. The next fish we're going to be looking at is the cat fish now this heals one and a half hunger when raw three hunger when cooked and has 65% catch rate so it's similar to the carp although it's a little bit rarer it also can be used to heal wolves so that's pretty awesome the next fish we're going to take a look at is the salmon now the salmon is caught with blood worms it heals no hunger whatsoever when raw although it does have an interesting side effect which you can probably see now although if you do have the chance to cook the salmon it will heal three and a half hunger so that's pretty awesome it has a 60% catch rate so it's not too rare and yeah, so the next fish we're going to take a look at is the goldfish. Now, the, both of these, whether it be cooked or raw, heal nothing. The only properties these have are regeneration, so it's similar to a regeneration potion. The raw one heals for about 5 seconds approximately, and the cooked one heals for about 10 seconds, so that's pretty awesome. And the pink one, and they're pink when cooked, so that's pretty awesome. The next fish we're going to take a look at is the mackerel. Now this heals one hunger when raw and three and a half when cooked and a 60% catch rate. And use an earthworm to get these. Okay then, so the next fish we're going to take a look at is the trout. Now these heal half a hunger when raw and four hunger when cooked. And they have around a 60% catch rate, so they're still not too rare again. So the next fish we're going to take a look at is the rainbow trout. Now these heal two and a half hunger when raw and five hunger when cooked. They're cut in the same way as you catch a trout by using a feather. And they've around the same rarity from what I've seen, so they are a very cool fish. 
So now we're going to take a look at the angelfish. Now these have got a really good idea what they did with these. They healed two and a half hunger when raw and then three and a half when cooked and they have around a 50% rarity so they're sort of rare. They, you can still get them easily but you just have to have a little bit of time and patience. And the thing I really like about these is they give you like the sprint potion when you eat them so you can sprint really quickly. So that's a, a really good way of getting that. The next fish we're going to take a look at is the demon fish. Now these heal two and a half when raw and three and a half when cooked and have around a 50% rarity again. And these give increased strength when cooked. So that's really good. Next one we're going to take a look at is the ender fish. Now these are a really good idea as well. This is like the same concept as the angel and demon fish, except these heal two and a half when raw and three and a half when cooked. They still have a 50% rarity, but instead of giving you like the sprint or the strength or whatever, these give you damage resistance. So that's a really good idea. And yeah, so that's all the fish in the mod. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to go and get the mod, there's a link in the description to the mods thread. On there is a full installation instructions, download links for everything you'll need and the works. And um, there's also crafting recipes and everything on there. So everything you need to get started is on the thread. So if you enjoyed this video, a like would be awesome. It does help me out a lot. Also, if you haven't already, subscribe would help too. And if you want to go ahead and check out the last mod spotlight, which I did on the Atmos Mobs mod, there's a link at the end of this video. And I will see you all on the next video. So cue the awesome music.